Okay, hello everyone. I'm Thiago Carneiro, postdoc at the University of Luxembourg, and I'm here to present towards ultra scale exact optimization using Chapel. The other, other author of this paper is Professor Nurdin Melab from the University of Lille, in Lille. The context of this work is uh, three based search algorithms for solving permutation based combinatorial problems, for, for instance, backtracking. This kind of problem, we, be, we begin with the initial state of the problem. We get this problem. We branch it, branch it generating pr uh, problems more restricted than its father node. Then we evaluate the new generated subproblems. And the unfeasible ones, we prune them. And the feasible ones, they go to the active set. And this branching, bounding, pruning uh, procedure continues until the active set is empty, which means that the, the, the whole solution space has been fully evaluated. What, what happens here is that these, uh, those prunes makes the shape of this tree quite irregular. So we have a, a computer demanding application, and which is quite irregular. So in this kind of uh, application, the work distribution, the load balance is crucial for, for achieving, achieving scalability. So our objective is to revisit the design implementation of parallel tree-based search for solving big permutation-based combinatorial optimization problems to the optimality on ultra-scale supercomputers, but dealing with scalability, heterogeneity, but we want to keep, we want to achieve productivity awareness. But is there a high productivity language that favors both productivity and performance? And how to address the scalability and heterogeneity while keep productivity. And in this context, what, what do you expect, expect from a productivity language? I, I expect performance because I'm, I'm, uh, so, I'm solving combinatorial optimization problems with optimality. So I, I, I expect that the performance of this language is competitive to both C and MPI plus X. I need C interoperability because uh, we have some legacy code, complex code that we don't want to change. And we want to use accelerators such as uh, GPUs. And we want some distributed programming features such as uh, one-sided co one communication. We want to hide aspects of the communication. So PJS, maybe it's PJS, PGA, PJS is the answer for this. And we, we also want some work distribution because uh, Work distribution and load balancing because we are dealing with irregular applications. And Chapel has all those features. So that's why, we, after some experimentation, we started to use Chapel for the design implementation of tree based search. Okay. The first ap application was a prototype distributed backtracking for solving any Queen's problem. Any Queen's is not a permutation based combinatorial problem, but it's a permutation based problem. And from the, 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 the any Queen's prototype, we can extend this prototype for solving permutation based combinatorial problems. So we first pr prototype with the Queen's, then we go for solving a, a permutation based combinatorial problem. And uh, our objective here in this uh, first, first uh, prototype was to compare to uh, uh, this, the performance of this application, its scalability to its uh, MPI plus X counterpart to see whether or not Chapel is feasible for, for such a task. Okay. In this algorithm, we, we, we are using here one algorithm that, that uh, comes from the, the, the multi-core programming. It uh, it's, looks like an a, a intranode algorithm. But as we are using PJS, they, they look alike. But this algorithm it states, uh, it, it starts on, on CPU, locale zero. Serially perform what we call partial search. In the partial search, we, we only evaluated a, 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 a fraction of the solution space. In this partial search, that's a serial task zero, locale zero, we, we enumerate our feasible value and incomplete solution of size cutoff. In this context of permutation based combinatorial optimization problem, uh, a, a feasible value and incomplete solution of size. Three means that uh, it's uh, 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 this feasible value and incomplete solution has three elements of the permutation. And this pool is the pool we use for the distributed search, is the load we generated for the distributed search. So uh, this for all 
the semantics of this for all is a distributed search that uses both distributed and intra-level modes of parallel uh, levels of parallelism. What's interesting here for us is that we don't have to implement termination criteria, met, uh, communication for metrics reduction, and uh, and we also uh, by using this uh, iterator we use both levels of uh, parallelism. So this iterator implements a master worker model that uses both level of parallelism and performs load distribution among the locations. Okay. And uh, I'm not uh, going really deep uh, into this uh, comparison between uh, C and, and MPI because there is a better one afterwards. But as you can see here, the, the chapel based uh, version, it's much smaller than its MPI plus X counterpart. Because in the uh, here, as you can see, I, I had to omit a lot of uh, details of the MPI code. So in this uh, this one I'm showing here for Chapel is more or less the the whole the the whole uh, Chapel based application. So it's much more high level. And in terms of uh, scalability, we could reach uh, eighty five percent of the of the speed up. The MPI. Uh, application can reach. So for our first, for our first implementation, for prototype implementation, uh, we, we got some competitive results. So okay, Java is feasible for, for solving, for, for the design implementation of three basis search. So as we have a good prototype, prototype that works, let's extend this prototype for solving combinatorial optimization problems. But the problem we face it is that uh, rely on, on the iterator for using both levels of parallelism did not did not scale well for for combinatorial optimization problems because the loads that the loads produced the the shape of the tree is much more irregular. So we had to to improve the way we are using intra node parallelism. So instead on instead on relying instead of relying on the iterator. For each node of the chunk, we perform a second generation of partial search, generating a task uh, 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 intralocale pool. And after we generate this pool, by using a second generation of partial search, we apply the intra, intra node iterator for using all the CPU cores. By doing this nested search, we can get uh, almost four times more performance. Our branching bound is now is now much more efficient. We use the intra node resources much more efficiently. Okay. For now, instead of solving the the any queens problem, we we solve to the to the optimality instance of the of the flow shop scaling problem, uh, permutation based combinatorial optimization problem of assembly line, and we compare the Chapel code versus a uh, state-of-the-art MPI plus P-thread code, state-of-the-art that, that uh, has a auxiliary mechanism for load balancing. In terms of, of, uh, of performance, with performance I say here, the execution time, Chapel is, is comp has some uh, competitive results, sometimes it's faster than the MPI-based code. But in terms of scalability, we have some competitive results, as, as one can see here, but for the smallest instances, the, the, the more challenging ones, the, the, the built-in uh, work distribution could not provide the regular load uh, among locales. So we had here those uh, scalability problems for the smallest instances. So there is room for improvement in terms of, uh, of uh, scalability in Chapel. In terms of programming costs, the MPI code is something like six times more, more, more costly, if we can say that, than, uh, than the Chapel code. But why? Because the biggest uh, fraction of the, of the MPI code is the state-of-the-art work ceiling mechanism, which pays off because, as, as one can see here, the MPI code can keep more or less 90% of the linear speed up but for the, the most challenging instances. So, okay, it's six times more costly, but the, the, the work shooting mechanism is, is much more efficient. And we extend this implementation with the, 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 
he proved, he proved he, he drew no parallelism for using GPUs. We, we cannot use the GPU iterator model because Chapel doesn't provide official support for the for GPUs. We could use the GPU iterator model, but the problem here is that GPU iterator model doesn't have load balancing, and we are you we are so we are here with a, a quite irregular application. So we need some load balancing in order to achieve uh, scalability. So. And also this is a prototype for solving any queen. So what we did here, we kept the same scheme, uh, introno, uh, distributed iterator for, for uh, work distribution. The intro node, the same nested parallelism, but this, the intro node pool, we offloaded onto the GPUs. So, he, but here we lose some productivity because uh, this work distribution, pointed arithmetics, get, getting the result, the results from the GPUs, we do by hand. But okay, this also pays off because uh, by by combining Chapel and CUDA here, we can reach 90% of the linear speed up solving the Enquins problem. This work is a cooperation between uh, Here Lead and the uh, Habanera Extreme Scale Software Research at Georgia Tech. Professor Vivek Sakai and Akihiro Ayashi. Oh, as you, you, you one can see here, the application that's based on the GPU iterator that, that, that doesn't have load balancing can only reach 60% of the linear speed up on 48 GPUs. And here, uh, in our using our scheme, 90% of the linear speed up. The best, the best of the words here, it would be if we could use the GPU iterator with uh, in the GPU if the GPU iterator had a uh, load balancing because we could have a, a it would be, it would have been a, a, a huge step towards productivity but uh, that's not the case and we started some uh, large scale experiments using 288 GPUs we can reach 86 percent of the linear speed up compared to a single location to the single locale version of the application oh compared to this the same application on one locale and compared compare to uh, uh, optimize it to the C baseline, we reach 74% of the linear speed up on 288 GPUs. And some conclusions is that Chapel is feasible for the design implementation of uh, heterogeneous distributed research. We had to hand, to hand redefine ready, ready some features like the second level of parallelism, the intra node level of parallelism. We had to use some C interoperability. Concerning the programming cost, uh, our comparison Chapel versus MPI plus X, Chapel is almost six times less, less costly, if we could say this, less costly. And thanks to the global view, we do not have to implement term, uh, termination criteria, metrics reduction, we didn't have to use additional library, the communication is transparent. But okay, there, there is some room in terms of uh, scalability for us. So we want to implement, we start, we start to investigate how to implement a work stealing mechanism uh, and maybe provide this as an iterator for the community. Also, we want to use the GPU iterator, but it doesn't have a uh, load balancing. So we want to incorporate some kind of a load balancing into the GPU iterator so we can have a heterogeneous application that use both CPU and GPU and that scales. And finally, as uh, we are, we, we, we want to solve some big uh, combinatorial optimization problem instances, we have to, to provide some uh, fault tolerance mechanism, but uh, we are going to use some checkpointing, okay? We need this, this checkpoint, because as the computers, they are getting bigger, they are also getting less uh, reliable. So we don't want to start a big experiment and lose everything we did. So we need to implement some checkpointing in those three our future works and some of them we have already started and if you have some questions i would be glad to answer them and if you if you want to see the 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 the, the code for the queens we can see uh, on this uh, repository the the only the the, the the queens code the branch about code is not there yet but it's going to be okay so thank you